we have the recent nations israel and palestine in news uh, what we would be doing today is understanding the basic geography of the region so if we look on to this region here we have a map of israel and let's talk about the neighboring nations so we have in the south egypt in the north is lebanon towards the east the major uh, countries are syria and jordan now one of the major lakes that surround here is dead sea dead sea is known for its high amount of salinity and as a result uh, this is uh, a region which is extremely rich in mineral deposits as well uh, because of the salinity uh, if you are float if you are swimming you actually try to you you would float in that area the next is the sea of galilee sea of galilee near the golan heights is one of the areas which is known for very high fertile soils uh, which is a small patch we would say rather there is an elaborate desert in the south of israel which is the negev desert where you have a rainfall of less than 1 cm but with the drip irrigation this region has turned out to bring in a huge amount of production in the area now again uh, it adjoins to the mediterranean sea as a result you have olives figs which are seen as one of the major productions in the region also if we talk about uh, the animal species since the southern part is the desert area you have hyena as one of the major animals that can be seen roaming around in the north in the fertile belt you have boars as the common animals and then in the marshland in the coastal areas definitely the caspian turtles are a common sight so those are some of the common um, wildlife or animals we could say which are seen now when it comes to palestine the region which is marked with yellow is one of the regions which is uh, actually considered as a region comprising of modern uh, israel but has a palestine territory of gaza west bank uh, and the region is known for the holy uh, place jerusalem uh, also we have some of the important sites uh, which are part of the region now if we talk about israel as whole israel has nearly 75% of the population with, uh, who believe um, in jewism or uh, judaism now again 20% of the israelis adhere to the 600 rules in their religion which they follow on a daily basis shabbat is maintained which is uh, from the uh, from the friday evening till the saturday evening they consider it as a uh, day of rest which is the shabbat uh, the shops the uh, market is closed for that period also there are some interesting rituals for example it is known as bit mitwas uh, where when a boy turns 13 and a girl turns th uh, 12 they are allowed to make their own religious decision kosher is one of the food that they uh, actually uh, cherish and that's without meat without dairy product uh, some of the cheese has been exempted from it so that's some of the important aspects from the cultural aspect and the spatial aspect that we have discussed uh, from uh, the region of israel and uh, palestine a very very important development and some of the major centers as you can see in the map uh, in israel you have tel aviv as one of the major centers then you have jerusalem uh, the region of gaza then we have dimona in the region close to the negev river a uh, desert nazrat uh, which is close to the sea of galilee and is one of the fertile areas so those are some of the important centers that you must be aware about so thanks for joining in today in case you have um, like we would be covering numerous topics under geography so if you have any questions or queries feel free to connect back thanks for joining in